It's a brand new found comet. It was discovered on March 29th by Skywatcher Vladimir. I think it's Bzugli. I think that's how you pronounce his name of uh, the Nepro uh, Ukraine uh, who found it. And then uh, it was in fact followed up on it. It's this new uh, comet. So it is called Comet uh, C2025 F2 Swan. And uh, this weekend is the best weekend to look for it. We're getting reports that it is already visible to the unaided eye, which is really oh. exciting. Some of our um, some of our uh, astrophotographer friends have been sending us great images of it. And so, uh, uh, if you are looking to try to see this comet, you need really dark skies. It isn't like the brightest. It's not like a great comet uh, because you know even um, uh, I. Th I th I think at its uh, closest point, it's going to be like 89 million miles away, something like mm -hmm. that. This weekend is, is you know, I've been told by our experts at space.com, like it's the best time to really look for it because after this weekend, you know, getting into mid next week, it's going to go into the Southern Hemisphere. It will be a Southern Hemisphere primarily object at that point in time. So great for everybody in Chile, not so great for us. And, uh, and so I, I advise anyone, if you can get out to really dark skies, you know, check out one of these guides, uh, see, see where it is in your, uh, in your night sky and let me know if you can see